Every day, 315 million Europeans use the internet. More than half of them make payments via the internet banking services, keep in touch through social media and shop at online stores. The digital economy is growing seven times faster than any other sector by generating products with high added value and creating new jobs. At the same time, 100 million Europeans do not use the internet. Although many have some knowledge of IT, half of all employers encounter difficulties in finding appropriate workers. The National Library of Latvia holds more than 4 million books. However, it is no longer possible to contain all knowledge on bookshelves. Only a fraction of global data remains undigitalized. Nowadays, libraries no longer deal exclusively with books, but rather provide access to information. For instance, last year, the National Library of Latvia not only opened its building to visitors, but also launched its digital branch. Internet search results, mobile banking transaction data, satellite images, surveys and other bulk data, as well as statistics and results of online public opinion polls. These are the components of the so-called big data. They are among the resources for digital economy, just like raw materials at a factory. That is why they are essential for entrepreneurs throughout Europe, especially in studies on healthcare, urban planning and crime fighting, as well as natural disaster and weather forecasting. We increasingly rely on electronic sources of information instead of heading to a library. Therefore, cloud computing is expected to become the main driving force of the European economy in the next six years by creating 2.5 million jobs and adding around 160 billion to the European Union budget. Efforts to make information accessible to enterprises and organizations should go hand in hand with ensuring security. The Latvian Internet Security Watchdog, CERT.LV, receives an average of eight warnings about dangerous incidents in Latvian cyberspace every day. Therefore, accessibility of information must be balanced with protection of freedom of speech, privacy and human rights. Although the unemployment rate is still high in Europe, IT companies are experiencing a shortage of specialists. In the coming years, it is expected to have up to 900,000 vacancies in the IT sector. The annual demand for IT specialists in Latvia has reached 3,000, while the number of IT graduates is only 1,500. Representatives from the parliaments of EU member states will discuss these challenges to the digital economy in April in Riga at the meeting of the chairpersons of the committees of the Economic and Digital Affairs.